Hey everyone, I'm here in the capital city of Vietnam, Hanoi, and I found a place that's close to home, New York City Pizza. Now I'm a New Yorker, I know good pizza. Let's try it. They sell pizza by the slice. A New York City pizzeria in Vietnam. This is a, a weird find and unique. Hey, they even have this mural that I've seen in New York. Statue of Liberty pizza. An incredible place. Yeah, cheese, vegetable, pepperoni. So they have a story here. It's a love story. They're busy making the pizza here. We got a picture of Times Square on the wall. Here it is, the cheese slice for 55,000 dong or $2.20 with today's exchange rates. Looks like a genuine New York City slice to me. Okay, I can be a harsh critic because I'm from New York. It's kind of interesting. It comes in a little like triangle like this. I love the design. Let's uh, pick it up New York style and fold it. Um, not a good sign when it cracks like that when you try to fold it in a New York City way. Kind of hot actually. Um, Yeah, maybe I need a napkin to hold this. It's kind of hot. Have a nice day. Okay. The uh, underside of it looks good. I just didn't like how um, overcooked it was. I think they put it in the oven too long, but let's try it. This is a very good New York City style pizza. Um, very crisp, love the dough. The dough is the best part of this. The cheese is very good too. And the sauce is a little bit tangy. Mm. New York will approve for sure. The price is good for New York City prices, but for Vietnam prices, it is kind of expensive. Um, kind of wish there was more tomato sauce on this though, but you can't really complain too much. I think it's going to be hard to beat this in Vietnam. I just love the crispiness of it. It's so good. Feels like a nice warm like bread that you're biting into. Mm. It reminds me so much of um, New York City for sure. And they do the cheese very good here, which I really, really um, admire. Mm. It definitely satisfies the craving if you want a New York City pizza.
Genuine slice. I want to try the crust on this. I think it might be a little bit better if they took it out of the oven sooner, but like this is very good too. Mm. I love the decor in this restaurant too. Um, nice pictures on the wall, great story was a love story that came out of this. A couple fell in love, they went to New York and they came to Vietnam. They couldn't find a place like this, so they opened their own pizza shop. What a great story. Whoa. This crust is pretty good. Mmm. Wow, that is so satisfying to eat. My crust is just like... Um, really, really good. Mmm. Definitely a solid, solid New York City slice. I mean, it's not the best and not as good as like Joe's Pizza in New York City, which sets the standard for all other New York City slices, but this holds its own for sure. Definitely like on the same level as the average New York City slice. I'm not saying a big thing here for Vietnam, for sure. I love the presentation they do on this too. I get better than this. <laughs> Kind of like a stylized plate here. Not even New York City pizzerias do this. This is a great idea. I think more New York City pizzerias should actually do this and like advertise their pizzeria with the plate instead of just giving a generic paper plate or <laughs> or pizza box. I wonder how their pizza boxes look now. It'd be kind of interesting. But yeah. New York City Pizza here in Hanoi is getting a two thumbs up from a true New Yorker. And I've tried pizza outside of New York City before. Believe me, it's not just the water that makes New York City Pizza good. Um, they cannot possibly import New York City water here. And they make it really good. So come by and check it out for sure.